And I was like, it took seven months to get to Mars. And I thought, but my my journey over the last seven months has in many ways been more difficult. <laughs> I sort of like, yeah, but in a way, you know, I've sort of had to deal with more. <laughs> in the last yeah, seven months. Overcome. Overcome. Yeah, push through what are barriers. The, so so you're so you're the designated science expert, Tom. What happens then yeah. when they <laughs> on this podcast? You are <laughs> Yeah, this podcast that requires just just a science GCSE. You've, uh, read, you've, <laughs> you've read the first paragraph of the story, so you're the expert. What yeah, do you? Uh, yeah, what, yeah, what's science, um, welcome to Science Corner. Yeah, exactly, Science Corner. We're here with Dr. Tom Elwes. He got his doctorate at the University of Legends. <laughs> yeah, the lit, lit University of Party. AKA Oxford Brick. Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> He's a patron of the frat house. Boys are yeah. lit. <laughs> <laughs> the legend house. Yeah, exactly. um, yeah, so, so, so they what what's going to happen? So they discover there's water, and they're like, "This is mad." Then what? Uh, no, no. So there, there isn't water, <laughs> but oh, great! In the crater, there, there were signs that water flow existed in that crater mi- billions of years ago. But so they think they may be able to find signs of extinct life that once lived in the water. Mm. Like sort of science of bacteria and stuff. It won't be anything exciting. No one's like, and then what? And then they do what? Well, then it's a big discovery because they can prove that there's been life on other planets, and that means a lot because at the moment we we believe ourselves to be the only life in the universe. Why are we focusing on the UK or whatever in the UK? That the Earth, the Earth listenership. We should be focusing on getting bacterium from Mars to listen to the podcast. That's yeah. We don't know how far it this shit's broadcast. You know, this could be (laughs) being picked up. Are they we podcast ready? We could be the first podcast yeah. on Mars. <laughs> and then we come and all the bacteria is like, yeah, Tom and Ali are here. And we're like, hey, yeah. guys. And they're like, so apparently you guys were the best podcast on Earth. And we're like, yeah, that was <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And they're like, you talk to anyone from Earth? And they're like, no. We're like, yeah, that's about right. Yeah, yeah. Oh, best, podcast. Oh, best podcast on Earth. Um, so we should do that. i tell you what, though. Um, firstly, I hope... Matt Damon's okay. I assume he's still on Mars. Secondly, uh, I also think that how peak is it to not get that right as the NASA people to miss or to for the thing to pick up? I get upset. I get upset when I scrunch up paper and I go, watch this and miss the bin, let alone yeah. when, when it's seven months and then it's like, and it's crashed. <laughs> But it's like seven months to get there, but it's like years in development and building the crafts and everything to get there and the rover. It's insane. But I I listened to Elon Musk was talking about, because he's obviously going to try and send people to Mars. And he was talking about (laughs) the people who have absolutely everything when going to Mars, because the the time it will take to actually like build a ship, get it ready, and be able to send you to Mars. Like probably like a two and a bit year cycle to be able to do it kind of thing. Yeah, that's why I've done it. one thing it could be something as small as vitamin c right if they didn't have vitamin c eventually everyone would die just just because of not having vitamin c wow oh yeah, that's not good you have to be social you have absolutely everything for human survival when going okay um well that's probably why i'm probably gonna avoid going i guess that's probably the reason probably yeah. just leave it to the the, the losers yeah. Yeah. i fucking yeah. love vitamin c it's one of my oranges I had oranges this morning so what can you do um, would you be up for going and colonizing Mars, Tom? Absolutely not. I, lad, definitely not going to be. Lad, colonizing. <laughs> Already colonized my <laughs> uni, mate. <laughs> That's what they called me, the colonizer. The col- yeah. yeah, they did, but that was more of a racial thing. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, would you do it? No, why not? Uh, no, I don't. I, I would. Well, I may do it eventually if it became you know, very, very normal. I'll probably be colonizing Mars about the point that going to Mars was sort of being done by EasyJet, you know? Like that, <laughs> it come that far down the chain, you know? It's like NASA, and then there'll be some kind of sort of Concorde equivalent, and then like, mm. uh, and then what, when, it, when it's hitting EasyJet sort Easy of rocket. levels. That's yeah, but, Mars Mars and back for 34 euros. You get the Ryan, Ryan space, Ryanair, equivalent where it's like we'll take you to mars you will be dropped off at uranus but then you will be able to yeah. get to mars yeah. you will be able to take a, 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 a space bus, bus. Yeah. A trans, yeah transport easy bus 
<laughs> from from yeah from Neptune to Mars. Uh, but yeah, only eighty four euros, so very very competitive, very competitive. Very competitive yeah. Being cramped up in the seat for two years, yeah, not much leg room. <laughs> In <laughs> two years like this, but think of the savings. <laughs> and the, yeah, it's a it's a it's a two year rocket, but there will be no food provided. <laughs> food and drink. Pay for your own snacks. You will have to bring your own, and also that will cost a lot of money. <laughs> yeah. yeah, there's like yeah, one yeah. dude who's just got the flight ticket. He's like, I'm just gonna try and wing it. I've got a 500 mil bottle of water, and I'm just gonna try and make that last for two years. It's so cheap. <laughs> I'm a seven month on a space rocket. Like, think how fucking bored you would get. Not only would you get fucking bored, but also like, just imagine if you're just like, oh, about two weeks in, we're like, oh, I don't really fancy this. You know, oh, I've made a mistake. <laughs> Too late. Seven months ahead of you, then the rest of your life on Mars. Good luck. <laughs> don't really fancy it. I love how you go through the mental preparation. Then two weeks later, you're like. Bit dull, isn't it? <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. Turn around. Oh, what? Everything's red constantly. Oh, bit dull. Like, oh, that is boring, though. Imagine that. I don't know what you do. What's the point? Yeah, you don't want to be the first people to. to... No. I don't. Mars is a weird planet to want to colonize as well. I just, I don't know. If... But apparently, that's how you do the whole universe. You have to go to Mars, the closest one first, and then you go. <laughs> the next one, the next one. You sound like you're... It's not interrailing. <laughs> yeah, but apparently that's the best way to do the universe, to see the universe, yeah. mate. Go Mars. Yeah. you got to go Mars, mate. It's sick. And then... Well, you have to do it, actually, is that Elon said that you would have to build a sort of station because the quickest way to do it is go, like, via our moon and, like, slingshot around our moon. Mm, but it's, like, yeah, the best thing to do is you have to make some kind of space base where you could refuel on the moon and then sling off to Mars that way. That's the best way. And mm. then eventually you make a base on Mars... And then from Mars, you'll make a base on. You can so once you like colonize Mars, it's easier to next one and the next one and the next one. That's the legendary bar crawl, the interplanetary bar crawl. Take you seventy it's years, great. but you yeah. start and you sling your way to Mercury, and then you work your way up <laughs> Venus, back to Earth, then back to Earth. Legends <laughs> come back, yeah. be like fucking Mercury was fucking mental. Then yeah. Mars, and then after that, I don't know what, how it goes. Neptune, Uranus, Jupiter, Saturn. Whatever the ones, mate. Pluto. They say it's not a planet, but tell you what, yeah. If you get enough fuel, you can get there. And when you get it, it's absolutely sick because like, there's no like, like the planet stuff doesn't come into. So like, pints are so yeah. cheap now. Like they don't even have a currency. They have nothing. Okay. So it's just absolutely sick. Yeah, exactly. And Six. Like, yeah, honestly, nothing. honestly, the girls in Pluto are proper banging. Like they are fucking <laughs> <Yeah>. sick. <laughs> literally years either. So it's like crazy. Yeah, yeah. Literally, like no one goes there. So like when you go there, everyone's like, oh my god, these legends have come. And yeah, like. <laughs> Like to be honest, yeah, I was like ninety one when I got there, so I was pretty, pretty docile. Pretty old. Still, yeah. still yeah. sick. It was so good. Go can. Right. We can do uh, that. That'll be the a diff interplanetary bar crawl. Yeah, we'll, we'll try and be the first podcast on Mars if possible. And you can stay uh, in the right. Sesh Hotel. So there's that. There's two packages. We offer two packages on the a diff holidays. There is the Butlins Weekender. Uh, yeah. For lockdown, and then com oh, yeah. completely That's opposite. So no request for the for the, for the, no. for the a week a week of the sun two weeks in Butlins we, like what we, we we do we do have a request we do have a request uh, George message the Patreon George uh, thank you very much for listening message the Patreon saying he is booking into the hotel the Sesh Hotel so yeah. so we've got one yeah. there so if anyone wants to join George then you're more than welcome yeah so we've got that the two two package holidays yeah the three of us that's all we need mate girl slows down with the drinking anyway. Uh, so, then, <laughs> so, then, so we've got two packages. We've got one, which is the Sesh Hotel in lockdown. And then the other is very different, complete nine planet. And yes, that includes Pluto, nine planet, Sesh, Barkle. Galactic tour. Galactic, galactic tour. tour. Galactic tour. <laughs>